That's how computers work. How computers work. Um, don't Alt F4. What's up, everybody? This is Scotty from Play What Now, and this is the Pwn update number 82 for the week of February 17th, 2014. If you're watching this, I got a spoiler alert for you. You missed Valentine's Day. But it's not too late to get into his or her good graces with a last-minute makeup gift. Here's a freebie. Steam will so shortly be coming out with a game called Goat Simulator. It is exactly what it sounds like. Is he or she not a gamer? I make house calls. What's up? Also, don't forget that anything you post down here in the comments, we'll read it, probably put it up on the screen here, and hell, if it's stupid, we'll do it, because eh, we have no lives, we're shame. We're entertainers, and not even very good ones, so we need your help. Like this comment from... Hey, that's from me, who says, Steve hates it when you pretend to be Harry Carey. Read the releases as Harry Carey. Okay. Read the hell releases this week. Cross platform. Rayman Legends. Did that game come out? John. John. Came out. That game already came out. This one's on the X-Bone and the Pest Force. Earth Defense Force 2025. That's a good game. It's about bugs in Japan. Except that they call it Detroit. That game's coming out of 360 in the PS3. And Strider. That's coming out too, I guess. Free games on Xbox Live Gold. Dead Island wasn't your thing? That's fine. You must be alive. How about Toy Soldiers Cold War? It's about Toy Soldiers. On your Steve console, the Wii, you, me, Donkey Kong Country. That's an old game. And on the PlayStation Portable. That, is that, is that still supported? I got one. Tom Batu. I don't know what that is. No word if that's coming to the end gauge yet. Here's Steve. Comes with. Thanks, Scotty. Yeah, it's me again. No Steve. Cause it's, uh, you know, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day, right? Wiggles Awareness Day. Oh, and you just made me sad. Slash wrists. Read the news. Alright, reading the news. Like Steve, because this is how he does it. Because it's Steve and he's lazy. So, anyway. Oh. I actually pointed out this news story specifically for Steve. So it makes me extra angry that he's not here. But, uh, you know, Steve's the one that gets butthurt about games that just beat him. Because, you know, uh, he's terrible at video games. But anyway, um, the fictional country from Papers, Please, one of the best indie games out there, was modded into Civilization V. So if you want to proclaim the glory of Aristroiska, you can do it now. It's awesome. Uh, other news. Ubisoft announced earnings from last quarter were down 35% from the same quarter as last year. Uh, they said that it's, you know, this is, console transition. Uh, I'm trying to do air quotes while holding a, a book, which is very hard to do. So, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, funny ears. Nice. Um, <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, so, yeah, they say Watch Dogs will fix this when it comes out eventually. Uh, in other words, in other news, uh, Watch Dogs was delayed on the Wii U because no one has a Wii U. Oh, speaking of Wii U, uh, uh, there was a Nintendo Direct, uh, actually just like a couple days ago, and uh, Nintendo announced a couple of things, I guess. Uh, Mario Kart 8 is getting the Koopa Kids as playable characters, so that's something. Who cares? I, yeah, it's like, you know, they, they were making it such, into such a big thing. They were saying, oh my god, these are special characters that... People haven't seen before, and like, oh, I, this is gonna be something. Maybe they'll throw in like some other Nintendo characters. I oh, okay, it's just more turtles. Okay, nice. Um, other news. Oh, Smash Brothers. Uh, they announced a new character finally. Uh, Little Mac from Punch Out. Woo! So, yeah, that's happening. Scotty's pumped. Woo! He's very pumped. So, yeah. Okay, so that that was something. Um. Oh, uh, some b weird, weird news. So, former Steam director Jason Holtman, who was actually one of the primary people responsible for making Steam the amazing juggernaut of cash that it is, uh, he left 
Valve like six months ago to go to Microsoft to help them out in their games department. And this one was actually sounding really awesome. People were like, oh my god, this guy knows what he's doing. He, he, he just revolutionized, just rejuvenated the entire PC market. He's, this is big shit. This is amazing. And, uh, uh, he left because, uh, he didn't like it there, I guess. I don't know. Um, no reason made public. No reason made public. So, yeah. Good job, Microsoft. Uh, oh, we talked about this. Candy Crush Saga, King owned by King.com. Uh, they made a trademark for the word candy and the word saga. And as a result, we have just gotten the first casualty of that, which is Candy Swipe, which was a game that actually came out Two years before Candy Crush Saga was released. They didn't want to do the lawsuit, so they bowed out. Because King.com is a bunch of motherfuckers. That's censored, right? Motherfuckers. There we go. Adorable. So, yeah. Um... All right, just just one final news story, and that's it. Um, the guy who did, uh, who created the the game Flappy Bird, which was just an un unbelievable success for like like a couple of months, uh, he decided to take his game down uh, because he said that the game was too addictive. That people were actually yelling at him for making the game too hard or too easy or whatever. I mean, the dude was harassed so badly that he took down his game that he was making $50,000 a day with. Wow, nerds. You guys. You guys. I'm sad now. Singles Awareness Day. Sad. Okay. I'm going that way. <laughs> Steve's all butthurt. <laughs> you missed Valentine's Day. Good job. But there's... Oh, fuck. I had a joke for this. <laughs> Symmetry. I have to stare at myself frame by frame over the two hours it's going to take to render this. I don't want my hood to be crooked. <laughs> I make house calls. What's up? No, don't. Everybody's my badger's touching his nipple. <clears throat> Moving on. Actually, if you're in the in the middle of a battleground in World of Warcraft, definitely Alt F4. That automatically lets you win the game. 